hybrid reactor. Roll off. What's up, Reactorize? I'm John. I'm Mike. And uh, we were on a bit of a hiatus for uh, Legends of Tomorrow. We missed a week, but we're catching up. So this, we're going to be catching up. Uh, this is uh, episode two, season two, DC's Legends of Tomorrow. Let's check it out. Let me see. Let's talk for a minute. I mean, after all, you're my... What kind of heroes are they? Punching? Like that? Whoa! Obsidian! Shut off the light! Wow! Whoa. Whoa. Wow! Whoa, that's creepy. Whoa! Oh, yeah. Oh, damn! Oh my god! That was like violent. <laughs> <laughs> Those are the numbers on your dog tags. They're not disclosed on any documents, military or otherwise. How do you know that? I'm your grandson. You gave these to your wife after the birth of your son in 1955. The dent on the front was from an assassin's bullet when you saved President Roosevelt in 1939. Your son passed them down to his son. Me. Thickens. Oh. Oh. Tell me what the heck is going on here. Well, we tried explaining. I'm sorry, ma'am. I was addressing the team leader. Oh. Damn. Oh, 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 well, uh, simply put, we actually never mentioned meeting you at all because you're dead. <laughs> I mean, where I come from, you're, you're dead. You're a hero to me. I'm a hero to a lot of people. That's the job. Of course. What a dick. All right. Uh, haircuts and love. Oh, come on. <laughs> Those guys were precise, professional, in constant agreement. We can't even agree on whose turn it is to make dinner. Not it. I can't <laughs> argue. In the meantime, we need someone who can make the tough calls. Who? Let me guess. You're volunteering. With all due respect, Raymond, I, I think there's a reason that Mr. Tyler just naturally assumed ah. I was in charge. Yeah, because Mr. Tyler is from 1942, and you're some old white dude. Hey, <laughs> improve of my plan. I'm just saying we're dropping into the middle of World War II here, and you're not exactly a wartime consigliere. Uh, <laughs> but I guess you are. I, or perhaps you would prefer the arsonist, the assassin, or the incredible shrinking man. I'm just saying, <laughs> you're smart and analytical and stuff, and real deliberate. But when bullets start flying, analytical's not gonna cut it. Well, thank you for pointing out my inadequacies. Oh, come on, Gray. It's Captain Gray now. <laughs> I'm a historian. It's a long story. Um, hey, where do I go to get a gun? <laughs> you ever shoot someone before? Jacks? Yeah. What about Jacks? They're in Germany. Yeah. Not to Germany. Yes. With Jacks. Jacks. Yes. Stay on the comms. He's right there. <laughs> I think I got something. The lady with the animal powers. But she looks different. How do you explain that? <laughs> they did it because they're not explaining anything. What? That. May I? This is a uh, maybe a progressive faction. What are you doing? A progressive uh, Nazi Nazis. Not for long. What? Give me your team. And uh, please, no Negro music. Soon. Not <laughs> where the hills are alive with the sound of music. <laughs> QA, watch me for the changes and try to keep up. <laughs> One, two, three. One, two, three. I don't think you can really sing. We're gonna find out right now. Fatal voice, 
Salute to Fiora. Oh, yeah, sure I did. I'm all about saluting your Fiora. You're lying. I was watching you the entire time. <laughs> uh, you know, I, I have a little crick in my neck. <clears throat> ha! <clears throat> oh, hell. Oh. Oh. Why do you get to punch? Oh. Oh. Ooh. Oh, someone just died. What just happened? Oh. What the hell are you doing here? <laughs> I know my cuts and bruises. You're a hemophiliac. Oh. Your blood doesn't clot, wounds can't heal, and if it's bad, you can bleed to death. Out there is history, and nobody knows more about it than me. Well, we've been managing just fine without you. Damn. Mostly fine. <laughs> this whole hero thing all wrong. If it's any consolation, Dr. Palmer, you're not really a hero. Damn! Damn. Get ready. Attack him now. <laughs> oh, there you go. I need to assess the situation. Krieg is getting away, man. Uh oh. Oh. Ooh. Attack on Titan? Fiction and Dr. Palmer need assistance. Copy that. But I think we have a new problem. Uh, wow. Wow. Oh! Gray, you gotta get him out of there. I just need a minute. Oh! <laughs> Oh, wow. Information first. This is not a science debate, Gray. Damn it, Jefferson, I know that. But for now, they're on their own. Yeah. No. How, how am I supposed to come up with a plan when I can't even hear myself think? Uh -oh. would, you, would you please uh, just leave? I, I, I need a moment to collect my thoughts. You need to resign as leader. Who's going to be leader? I don't know. Who else can be leader? You should know. You don't have to be a soldier to be a hero. Good talk. And we approach <laughs> from the southwest, destroy the... I can't let you do that. You don't have the authority. Yes. She does. She's the leader? Ms. Lance speaks for all of us. Don't do it. Don't help him. Oh! <laughs> Back to work. You didn't even go anywhere, just trained to miss. <laughs> no member of the JSA would ever help the Nazis. Neither would a legend. Ooh. The old Microsoft did a chest trick. <laughs> <laughs> Whoa. But Air Krieger is here right now. Oh. oh. <laughs> wow. <laughs> it's like Jurassic Park. Yeah. <laughs> Objects in here. Close to the here. Bombing run faster. about to commence. All faster. points get clear. Oh, crap. Oh. Such accuracy. <laughs> you did it. You saved us. Oh. oh! Oh, no. Oh. 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 Erased from the timeline. Like this. Rex? 
dead. Time. Time traveler. <laughs> oh, so you don't think it's the legends. Oh, no. No. Yeah. Rex, he's gone. <laughs> All right. Yeah. Um, yeah, he's... I don't know, was he that important of a character? Probably not. But <laughs> Reverse Flash is that important of a villain to kill this character. Yeah. So you better watch out. Reverse Flash is coming for you. Yeah. I, I don't... See, this is the thing, though. Like, with Reverse Flash changing the timeline, and then you got the... Legends... Also I, changing the yeah, timeline. I, I, I don't... It's a, time. It's a, it's a very cool concept, though. Like, you got the team... Just trying to prevent time from changing, and then you get Reverse Flash, who loves to change time, mm-hmm. and they're at odds. Yeah. So I think that's a good, uh, just a good way for uh, for them to fight each other. It's just, a, but then when you look at the Flash, and it's like as soon as he does one thing, it's like everything is just sucks, and everything is <laughs> yeah. out of order, and the world has changed drastically, and it's like, what if Reverse Flash changed things for his benefit, but somehow? The world gets better. <laughs> That'd be crazy. It's like, yeah. do we stop this man? He killed everyone I love dear to me, but wow, this is like world peace. <laughs> yeah, I, yeah, I don't know. I, yeah. I, it's whatever. It's a show, and it's going to be obviously the the setting that they you know put the legends in. But yeah, yeah, I mean, it's it's, it's still interesting. It's still an interesting concept. And then White Canary is a leader now, so she's yeah. going to be leading. She's pretty badass, and she always knows like how to fight and uh, just. She's been trained by the League of Assassins, so you, so she knows all about just, you know, battles. Yeah. So out of all of them, she would be like the best one to lead them into battle. A person yeah. that's experienced in battle compared to, uh, you know, uh, Doctor Martin Stein or Jax. Yeah. And uh, even Ray Palmer. Ray Palmer is like just a, uh, you know, like a rich guy, but now he's not even uh, he doesn't even own his own company anymore. Uh, so he's just traveling around. <laughs> so. White Canary. Yeah. Um, Sarah Lance. Yeah, at least she was uh, trained by the League of Assassins and Ra's al Ghul, so she's got that going for her. Yeah. And uh, so the Justice Society of America, they were they were pretty on point. Like, their powers at the beginning? Wow. Uh, like, what's his name? Obsidian just yeah. covering the sky. Yeah, just covering it in darkness. That was pretty cool. And the CG Krieger. Yeah. That was... It was some pretty good CG for a TV show. Yeah, not bad, especially like in broad daylight, because that's yeah. hard to do. And yeah. if you guys watch, you know, at least The Flash, you know, like, the majority of the big special effects, especially like Gorilla Grodd, Killer Shark, it's all night. It's what it's easier to, like, hide, you know? Yeah. If it's at night, they can hide it a lot better. Mm-hmm. But in the day, it's harder. Yeah, so uh, let's see what the Legends of Tomorrow is going to do in the future episodes. Uh, let us know what you guys think of. Sarah Lance as the new leader of the team. And if you enjoyed this video, please give us a like, subscribe to our channel. Also, I want to talk about our upcoming panel, which is this Saturday, coming this up Saturday. at Stan Lee's Comic Con. And if you're at the Los Angeles Convention Center, Saturday at noon, come check us out. We'll be in room 303A. Who are we going to have? Uh, we're going to have Ivy Doom Kitty, uh, Ejin from Cosplay in America. We're also going to have Artist Abe, and we're also going to have our good friend Jennifer Zhang. It's going to be a lot of fun. We're going to be playing some games, talking about nerdy stuff, giving away lots of prizes. You guys should definitely come out. With that said, I'm John. I'm Mike. And we'll see you guys next time. Here to talk about Sarah Lance, Ray Palmer, and the rest of the legends. I think they're all in trouble. Who are you, stranger? Thank you for not... I don't know the first thing about any legends. Of course you do.